Hey beautiful Aries, how you guys doing? Welcome to the Gifted Hermit. I hope you guys are doing mighty fine. I know some of y'all are real, real fine. <laughs> Seven of Wands, beautiful energy to start off this reading. And remember that this reading is not going to resonate with everybody. It's very general. And also the energies are transferable. What do I mean by that? This could be your energy or someone around you's energy, right? Someone that you're thinking of most importantly all right let's get into it seven of wands this is like a challenge i feel like some of you may have haters okay maybe someone's like <coughs> excuse me having something to say you know uh or sly little remarks okay maybe you feel like you're having to defend yourself or you're being personally attacked all right feeling vulnerable somehow right but the haters only emerge when you're shining right or competition may emerge um as a result of shining brightly in the world all right if you feel like you're being attacked after sharing your magic or your good news it's kind of important to remember that others um pretty much are jealous and they probably want what you have all right you've got something that others don't have or someone really wants right This is lovely though this is about protecting yourself you see the little bubble here really protect yourself have that bubble and protect yourself okay because you deserve success and you deserve to shine shine brightly in the world right um a lot of you have come far um spiritually if anything and you've really grown you're quite mature a lot of Aries are mature for their age all right um please remember if the reading resonates in any way to give me a thumbs up all right a lot of Aries are doing a lot of inner reflection with the hermit card there this is Virgo energy um a lot of inner work a lot of alone time and reflecting and thinking um this is spiritual growth okay this is about inner wisdom this is about being your own spiritual mentor and tapping into your own soul and what it is that you desire, okay? Um, and it's important. It's important to have time to yourself in solitary, okay? Sometimes we need to withdraw to connect to our own, our own compass and our own direction where it is we want to go in life, Aries, right? And finding our sole purpose in life. <laughs> it's about listening to your own inner mentor. It's about listening to your own inner guide. It's about finding the brightest light. It's a very beautiful card. Um, I really feel like a lot of you are in a very mature state of mind when it comes to <coughs> thinking about, excuse me, what it is that you want, where it is you want to go in life what it is that other people bring to the table. Are they helping you? Are they not helping you? You know, that type of energy. And it is, uh, it's commendable, especially for Aries. <laughs> what does she mean? What does she mean? I mean, that sometimes, you know, you guys got a temper. You can let people get to you. But it seems like you're really choosing spiritual growth and going within, okay? Um, you, you're using your logic with the King of Swords there and your intelligence um sticking to the rules um this is about thinking clearly this is about communicating strongly to others exactly what it is you need to communicate across okay um very brave very courageous energy very intelligent and diplomatic okay um you're making the right choices you're using your logic again and your intelligence about your future the future it is that you want all right um this is a uh, this is very nice to see very very nice to see moving on it only gets better with the world card aries all right so coming full circle with this card happy endings all right you're going to get your happy ending this is this is very beautiful okay i really feel like you guys are coming full circle really tapping in you've become very wise and you've grown from any situation that you've been through okay um very positive abundant um messages through tarot okay so congratulations you've come very far um maybe you've got a project or a period in your life um it's coming all into into success now it's all coming together all right 
you're on the right path. If you feel like you're not quite there yet, you are on the right path to this ultimate success, okay? Um, accept this gift of completion. Accept it, that you've come full circle. You're coming full circle. You're ascending into new levels and awareness and wholeness of yourself. A lot of you are ascending and maturing and leveling up. You're thinking about your future. You're thinking about how far you've grown. You're thinking about what it is that you've been through and how far you've come um maybe some of you are romanticizing you're visualizing you're manifesting uh your future right um some of you may be reconnecting you're thinking about reconnecting from people from your past okay it could be old old relationships family members lovers um this is also your inner child and what it is your inner child wants aries okay and, and thinking about your future self and what it is you want for your future, which aligns in with this reading, all right? Um, don't get stuck in the past. That's the shadow side of it, is getting stuck in the past. But I really don't think that you guys are going to get into that frame of mind, okay? This is about being at peace with your past. Letting go and being at peace with your past. Um, it's brought you to where you need to be right now, all right? So let's get you some angel cards. Guided messages, angels, please, for Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Two more shuffles, please, guides. And what does Aries need to know before we go? What does Aries need to know before we go? Guided messages. Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Again, Aries, this reading is not going to resonate with everybody, right? Ooh, beautiful. An exciting new opportunity. Career advancement. Change your life now, Aries. Beautiful. Ace of Wands. Going for it. Whatever creativity you have, you know, you're able to really work hard you know this is definitely new beginnings and coming full circle for you guys all right um do not miss the opportunity this came out reversed okay so i don't feel like you guys are gonna miss out the the, the opportunity and i do feel like you guys are quite content you know and if you're bored not aries aries will find something to do um open your eyes to the possibilities it's saying there all right there's so many possibilities out there for you time to buckle down <laughs> and get things done honor your commitments a guardian angel and this is loyalty uh loyalty dedication honorable kind to so stay loyal to your morals stay loyal to any promises and commitments that you've made all right um buckle down and get things done now's the time aries a very beautiful spread i hope you found it somewhat insightful and yeah please remember to give me a thumbs up if i resonate with you in any way love peace and light my sexy aries and i'll catch you on the rebound Mwah.